<laughs> hey, Chuck. Jesus Christ. Yo, Chuck. What's going up? Cool. And who do we have here? Ooh, a little chill built. <laughs> You're on YouTube. Do you want to show them your asshole? <coughs> Happy New Year. Moin Moin Kines. Hello everyone. Welcome back to another hair color related video because that is what I can do best and the only thing I can do. Oh, that's sad. Welcome to 2020. This is my first video in 2020. Let's start off with kind of a review moment. I just want to look back at 2019. Well, actually at 2019, 2018, 2017, 2015, literally my past life. <laughs> I saw a comment on a, one of my videos which was I should review all of my hair colors I had in my life and I actually thought that was a nice idea and I kind of also want to rate them. We all have mixed opinions about my past hair colors. I do, you do, Brett Mondo does. Mm. And I think we can all kind of have a moment for my past hair colors. Maybe we should also have a moment for this hair color because I don't even know what this is. But let's get to this later. I looked for pictures of all of my past hair colors and oh damn, I started dyeing my hair like very early. I also have like a very detailed hair color video which I made like two years ago which was basically just a video about all of my hair colors. That was before I started dyeing my hair like intense colors, right? Yeah, I had blue hair and all of the other colors I had were just like those teeny kind of experiments. And now I have adult experiments, so it doesn't even make a huge difference. <laughs> and of course I'm not gonna do that alone because why would I even like rate my own hair colors if I wouldn't have Vincent who would be a bit more critical. Will I? Well, I think you will. So you wanna you wanna rate it from over there, or do you wanna get into the frame? Do you feel camera ready? <laughs> Hi, I'm not covering up anything. Don't rip it off. It's a part of me now. Why did you rip it off? We'll leave in that in 2019. Okay. Wow. <laughs> oh. That's kind of weird. <laughs> Are you ready for the first one? For my absolute favorite already, like one in a hundred million thousand best hair colors ever. <laughs> <laughs> you know the drill. Mm. Love your dimples. Wow. Are they still there? Oops. That was um, my kind of getting into hair dyeing color. Like the first hair color I ever had apart from my natural <laughs> hair color, obviously. <laughs> I actually went with Vincent to the hair salon and got this hair color done and I wasn't that happy with it. But why weren't you? You wanted red and you got red. Yeah, but it was not the red I wanted. <laughs> okay. Actually, back then I felt so special with it. I was like, Your girl has the hair. Oh my god. How do you know? <laughs> and then all of my friends told me after I did not have this hair color anymore, they hated it. Ouch. Did I say that too? I think you did. I just thought it didn't really go with your complexion. Yeah, because I had red pimples on my face. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I didn't have them on this picture, but I think it's just very light and bright. And, um, you know, I just knew how to hide my pimples back then. So this is uh, not, not a good rating? I feel like now you could rock it. Yeah, well, I wear makeup now. <laughs> anyway, too much thinking about this picture. I'm going to rate it a 3 out of 10 broccoli. Oh. Yeah, I mean, I can just base it on uh, this picture for a out of 10 then. 4 out of 10? 4 out of 10. 4 out of 10. Thumbs up if you want red hair on me! <laughs> Which I always try to get, yeah, but I couldn't achieve. That's Sorry. <laughs> Pink! And with some purple ends. And a facetune face. Oh my god, don't even get me started <laughs> about my editing back then. I literally made myself look like a different person. Yeah, this was kind of an accident. I was uh, an au pair in England back then and my host family was actually on vacation and I dyed my hair this color and I was afraid they're gonna be super upset when they come back. They didn't like it, but I mean, they didn't kick me out, so. Unfortunately. <laughs> True. <gasps> I actually really like this hair color back then. This look cool, yeah. Mm -hmm. I just don't like this dip dye ombre look Oh, you anymore. don't? I actually no. like this. I mean, it's 2020. I think we can move on. Okay, <laughs> 6 out of 10. Oh, I'm gonna get a bit sad with the bathroom. <laughs> 
same. I don't know what, what my tongue did right there. I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10 broccoli. I still like that ombre effect. I'm stuck in 2016. I can tell. Oh, Jesus Christ. Next one. Oh. Hello, mama. Hello, sister. Hello, dad. Hi. <laughs> also, did you like volumizing my fair hair? I was gonna say, did you rip out all of your back hair and put it, <laughs> put it on the front? But yeah. Exposing myself. I still love this hair color so much. I just think it's boring. I just don't know about the blue tips. I love the blue tips. Okay, dogs. Oh my god, I'd love to just cut your hair off. Okay, I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10 as well. There's no explanation. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who is she? <laughs> okay, let's look at the hair. Kind of look like Selena Gomez. Do I? Yeah, the lips. I mean, I could, but why would I want to? Yeah, we're still in this. Um, I like this. I was gonna say that I prefer this to the faded blue. Okay, I'm actually gonna give it a 7 out of 10. But also because I'm just super thrown off by my fried hair. Okay, but I feel like you should should cut your hair off again. Are you gonna cut your hair off again? Am I gonna cut my hair off again? I think it looks more edgy. Next one. Oh, she was born. Wait, she was reborn. <laughs> no, it wasn't my first blue, but I think that was just my intense this blue. Ah. So the story behind this hair color is I did have blue hair before, but it was a faded blue. But this was my first social media job, basically. It was on a hair convention. It was actually two people working on my hair. They just wanted to refresh my hair color and they effed up and it was just not pretty. And then the next day they wanted to fix it. And then I said, just go full blue just just do it i was just like oh whatever and then this happened and i'm not mad about it it was just that time where i decided this blue will never get out of my hair again and it's still in your hair probably i still love that color though you don't <laughs> i don't really know oh on this picture i would give it an eight out of ten i don't really like it you give it a four out of ten to say what is a four to six? Maybe a six. Okay, four. <gasps> you hated me back then. No, I liked it back then, but somehow now looking at it, I don't really like oh, it. Oh, really? Yeah. Woo! Purpura. Purpuru. Did you just... Yep. Okay. <laughs> um... I hate it. <laughs> I'm not obsessed with intense purples anymore. It's just this hair color which everyone wanted to dye their hair when they were like, okay, let's dye my hair crazy color, which is not red. Let's do purple. I'll give it a two out of ten broccoli. Ooh. Oh, that's this dye. Mm -hmm. ah. Where I fell off the chair. I don't know. I really just want to chop your hair off. Four out of ten. Let's get to my go-to hair color for literally three years. Mm better yeah i still mm. really dig this color it was just so hard to maintain because it was super white right here and as you can see i already have my roots coming out and i just don't care anymore because my hair needs a break literally every person i ask they always say this was their favorite hair color on me <laughs> it's just still really hard to maintain it was so hard to maintain yeah um i like literally it. so so hard <laughs> <laughs> I like it, but I'm also glad you don't have it anymore. Yeah, because it's so hard to maintain. <laughs> it was just this turquoise kind Ooh, of I like this. Really? Yeah. This looks like a wig. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> I still think that's like a 7 out of 10. Let's get to the more not so long ago hair color. <laughs> so let's get to this sugar cotton candy kind of hair. I love this hair color. That was my first hair color I had after three years of having blue hair. I just like the pastaliness about it, the pastel the pistulu. I love it. I'll give this like a 9 out of 10. 8 for me. Okay. I also always have to think about Love Yourself, the album cover from BTS. I do. Next one. Boom. Time for Pam Comey. Oh, that's fun. Yeah, right. I, I already forgot about this super vibrant orange kind of. I lo 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 love this and this is also the shortest my hair has ever been. So yeah, that's I love probably this. Yeah. yeah, I love it, but I didn't love it when it washed out. I only loved it when it, when it was vibrant. Mm. 9 out of 10 for me because I loved it so much. For me it's a uh, almost a 9. Okay, I'm glad we can agree on that. <laughs> my hands are sweaty. You. <laughs> that I really like. That looks bomb. It was literally just the most spontaneous hair color I've ever had. I didn't make a video. I was just at my hairdressers and I was like, Let's do something fun. He was like, I'm okay. And I was like, Let's pee in my head. Then he was like, Okay. 
<laughs> that's how we talk. Yeah. <laughs> Can you do these colors but like split hair color? I had that. Right. <laughs> this looks bomb, bomb, bomb .com. This is um, almost a 10, but not quite. I hate your ratings. This is a 10 out of 10 because Naomi is forcing me to give it a 10 out of 10. That's not true. You have your own will. 10 out of 10. Yay. I like the bright orange better, to be honest. So this is a not 8 out of 10 for me. Broccoli Naomi. Why are you not saying anything? <laughs> I really liked it back then, but somehow now looking at it, I'm like, okay. I also liked it better back then when it was fresh and giving me a, like the real life broccoli surprise vibes. I really love your sweater in this picture. <laughs> <laughs> I also really love broccolomi. I'm gonna give her a 8 out of 10 broccoli, 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 broccolomis. Maybe an 8. I'm not quite sure about this. I'll have to sleep up with this. <laughs> okay, I'll ask you again tomorrow. <laughs> How dumb do I look anyway? Amazing. <laughs> Amazing dumb. Thanks. And what are you doing? I'm just switching up my hairstyle for the next shot. <laughs> I'm switching mine up as well. Oh, you got a hair on your nose. I like that. No, I hate myself. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, next one. <gasps> wow, she white. She is. That's very soon, isn't it? No. That looks cool. But don't forget about the blue tips. I was gonna ah. say, can we get rid of them? I think I really need to chop off my hair again. <laughs> I mean, I don't wanna brag, but 10 out of 10, bitches! <laughs> you on a roller coaster? <laughs> back to pink. Why did you cut yourself bangs? <gasps> Yeah, yeah, I was never made for bangs. In another life. Yeah, maybe. No, I like the hair color, I like the style, I like the picture, but I just don't like the bangs. But I'm still, I'm still just such a fan of pink hair. Look. My heart will always be... Go on. I think if I would have to choose one hair color for the rest of my life, it would be like a pastel pink. Because I think pink is just timeless, as you can see by my roots. I'm gonna give it a eight out of 10. Six for me. Um. Oh. Nah. I like the first yellow I did, which was this highlight uh, kind of yellow, like a neon yellow. This is piss yellow. <laughs> what are you pissing? <laughs> what? Yeah. That was Demon Ariana Grande. Yeah. <laughs> I was stuck with it forever because it just didn't want to wash out and nah, mm -mm, 3 out of 10 broccolis. <gasps> no, I wouldn't go, go that low. I would. <laughs> oh, cute. This looks like plastic. Yeah. True. It looks like a synthetic wig, uh -huh. like a bad one. <laughs> yeah. But amazing lace though. <laughs> I can't help it if I have like normal blonde hair or almost back to normal hair. It's just boring. Except for like brown hair. Stop making me want to dye my hair brown. It'll never happen. Comment down below if you no, want to have No, don't comment. Hair. But like black. No, black will be the end of my channel. Then I can literally just quit YouTube. Anyway, I'll give this like a 5 out of 10 because I don't care for it. Yeah, I mean if it were black then I'd give it 10 out of 10. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, let's get to the origin red pink that was like brad mondo's fave when he reacted to my hair oh i like it i felt comfortable in it i felt cute i wouldn't do it again to be honest i would say seven out of ten great hello tide pod this is actually very up to date i don't really like the shade of blue i love it i think that could be like my go-to hairstyle i'll give it a nine out of ten i already prefer the red and orange so okay yeah six out of ten maybe what do we think about this <laughs> this is fun. I hate it. <laughs> I did it for the Halloween spirit and well, it was fun. I would really say it's fun, but I don't like it. I hate fun. Yeah, it's fun for a week. A five out of ten. Taco says six. A oh, four? Cute. That is my hair color I actually have right now. It just faded. I love it. <laughs> I'll give it a 7 out of 10 broccolis. I won't. Oh, that was actually the last picture. I just have this beautiful picture with me in a marker. Mer 10 out of 10. Would bang! <laughs> good times, good times. So what's the best color then? You like this the best, right? Apparently, I didn't think I would, but yeah. Mm -hmm. I think my absolute favorite was the bright orange. <gasps> what? And this. So literally like warm and cold. 
Mm. Okay, so that was it. It's really interesting to see all of these colors in comparison, like literally next to each other. It's also funny how our opinions changed and we loved the hair color back then, but now we just think it's ridiculous. But I think that's life. You don't always support the life decisions you made back in time. I would love to hear what your favorite hair color was. I feel like that's literally what I ask in every video. <laughs> What's your next hair color gonna be? I just want them to come in black and I'm Gucci. Come in black, then Vincent is Gucci. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's actually it for this video. I hope your start into 2020 was great. I hope your 2020 will be great. Don't forget to follow me on my social media, which is Naomi John on Instagram. Naomi John Snap on. Snapchat. And the Naomi John on Twitter. I don't even know. Are these supposed to be runs or are you just like having. <gasps> okay. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Oh. Did you just smash your head into my MacBook again? Nope. Oh, oh no! Is it still okay? I mean your head as well. But. <laughs>